Hello everyone, welcome and thank you for joining this endoscopic spine surgery tutorial. Endoscopic spine surgery has received increasing popularity and enthusiasm over the last years and decades. And that is for a number of reasons of MIS surgery. For example, we have decreased tissue trauma, there is less blood loss, we have decreased post-operative wound pain of the patients and therefore a faster post-operative recovery and mobilization of the patients. We have shorter hospital stay. Many of the surgeries can actually almost be done on an outpatient basis and many, many others. So from my point of view, I think that one of the main advantages of this technique also is the fact that you can do this procedure almost independently of the patient's weight. It doesn't make a difference if the patient is 50 kilos or 150 kilos, you can still do this through the same small six, seven millimeter skin incision. And also the fact that you can almost eliminate the risk of infections or wound healing problems. My personal background is microsurgery. And even when you have a lot of experience with a microsurgical technique, there will still be some kind of learning curve when you change to the endoscope. This is what we are here for over the coming episode, we will show you a number of tips and tricks how you will master this procedure easily. So let's get started. <laughs> 